Hey guys and welcome to my first ever showcast for Minecraft.net and I will be showing you one of my personal inventions which is a mob arena with different settings for um, numbers and difficulties as you might want to call them for specific mobs and this is all 100% legit and I will show every bit how I made it so I hope you enjoy it so first of all we have the letters that go down to the actual thing the temple outside was just for decor and here we have the ladders going down in the stairs and a beautiful sign that welcomes you to the mob arena more likely, more likely your death and here we have the control room in which you preset everything from open and close this door that lets you, lets you in to the levels for skeletons here three different levels pre three different levels for three different doors that control the skeleton a switch for the door for the spiders and three different levels switches for levels of the zombies and in here we have a redstone room which I will show in just a bit so for each door there is a specific lever that will open and close it uh, which will allow or not for the specific uh, mobs to come out and in here we have the specific mechanics that it that it's used for uh, all of the other ones except for the spiders which was needed a uh, more de detailed maybe it had more need than just this basic because uh, spiders make a lot of trouble which I will show you in a little bit and so we have here a zombie spawner which is surrounded by water which flows in this direction which will make all the zombies spawn come here the water is blocked so they will fall down be collected by this water and be thrown outside and the way I uh, the way I did by placing these is I used a mod which is called spawner GUI which allows to take spawners um, and place them wherever you want and also choose which type of mob it will spawn and in here we have the zombies as you've seen and basically this is a design for all the zombies and the skeletons because they don't need anything and uh, the door for spiders is not open I'll open it now and for the spiders there was a sp there was a problem which implied them uh, how to say they would climb up walls if they were they had the possibility to and so water on the walls more more exactly waterfalls on the walls would, was necessary so that they would not climb except for these parts with, uh, which I've seen by test that they do not climb up because it is too close too close for the spawners and they will just go with the water until this point which a possibility was they would climb and in here here we have the water being stopped by the su <clears throat> by the signs which is a sign placed on a sign on a sign on a sign and so on and because because of the uh, uh, spiders that do not normally fall they usually again climb up walls I placed a waterfall as you can see right here that will force them to climb down to go down which where they will be collected by this water and be taken outside here normally they would might get stuck in the doors or so by them being multiple but them trying to come out when they see you that is that is more than enough for them to be able to come out and now I need to take all the and I don't see a single thing yeah so that's basically it for the rooms now I will show you the redstone room which isn't such a big deal because all it is is redstone going from on lever to the door 
actually the redstone goes to this block and on the other side there's a redstone torch which is right underneath the door and so which e with each, each lever there is for one door and that's all the mechanics for each the redstone mechanics at least not so complicated okay so the next thing I will show you is a quick demonstration of the mob arena and I will fight with two level of zombies, two of skeleton spiders on because a little bit of challenge is always needed and I will have basic uh, ladder cap, ladder armor bow, some food, some arrows and a sword so let's open the doors go inside and turn to normal, let us wait until they spawn the thing I love, and now I'll discuss about the something about the, the small marina that I, that I like and you can already hear this, the um, spiders the one thing I like about this type of mob arena uh, different from the others that spawn everything in one big room when they move is that you cannot control what type of mobs will spawn you cannot uh, control how many even though neither here but you can know about a, a some sort of round up how much and why well I forgot to turn on the zombies my bad and all turned off there we go, two levels. And also is that you can expand as much as you want. Actually not as much because after a certain point it becomes too big and you are too far oh damn. You are too far away from the spawner for them to actually spawn, so around five would be the limit as I've seen from my previous test, but for me 3 is a good enough round and I, as you can see I suck balls when this and I have actually asked for some friends of mine which were amazing fighters as I know and they said it's good at the beginning you get stuck until you get with the flow but after a while even, even if you get if you feel you get the control you actually get ambushed and eventually you will die because there are too many and too much and besides I'm gonna force them to come out a little bit there's too many I don't know why but they get stuck like dumbasses I don't know why they don't, they don't come out and also the structures adds a little bit of I don't know side ability because they might get they might hide behind something you might not know you might just Get around the corner. I don't know what. The spider gets stuck in the door for some reason. Oh damn! Nope. As you can see, they snipe from the shadows. Oh, you see, you see. Oh damn! Oh no. And here will be the time for me to grab some food, but I am so. Oh no. Oh no. Oh yes. Thank you. <laughs> this is the perfect time for attacking each other. Okay, I'm gonna. Oh! And so, with this, ends my presentation of my mob arena and my video. I hope you enjoyed it. Hope you like the design of it. And if I get f if I get enough feedback, I will actually do a video about how you build it all about designs of such like pillars and I also have a few more like um, I don't know I actually thought about making like a certain castle and the mod will just flow outside and that would be an idea but all that if I get enough feedback and if I decide to make a tutorial about it so yeah guys this is Nightpuppy hope you enjoyed my video see ya guys